What up, YouTube? Dr. Boomer here. Wanted to bring you guys a quick video. I know it's been a while since I posted, about a week or so. Uh, just going to give a couple of thoughts on the uh, beta stress test that was uh, about a week ago. Um, also show you guys some what, what I think is some pretty good Scarlet play. Not by me, uh, by this other guy. Uh, it's a Scarlet that's in the purple. I'm in the white. Uh, this guy totally kicked my butt, uh, which makes me excited because uh, that means that I can save this video and watch it and maybe get some ideas on some tech or something that I can add uh, once I get access to a practice mode. <laughs> um, but yeah, I just want to talk very quickly about uh, that. Also, um, I do want you guys to know that I am in the process of working on uh, the second episode of uh, my series on how to practice uh, while on the uh, while on a schedule crunch, <laughs> uh, schedule diet, I guess I don't know. Um, but uh, I am in the process of really making sure that what I have to deliver is really good quality, and so that's why it's taking me a while, and it's also been a very very busy week for me as well. So haven't been able to devote as much time as I would like. So uh, I'm hoping to have that done by Sunday. So just keep an eye out for it. But yeah, anyway, so yeah, the stress test last week. So good. So much amazing. Like Scarlet, I, I had a pretty good idea that I was going to be maining Scarlet in MK11. Uh, just based on some videos and everything that I had seen. Uh, she just kind of fits that archetype that I really like. Uh, you know, mid-range, spacing, good zoning, um, some, you know, magic tricks, I guess you could say. I don't know what else to describe it. Um, you know, she kind of reminds me a lot of Enchantress uh, and Raven and Zatanna, and that's just, that's just the archetype that I just really like. You know, just having really good spacing, Good control of the mid range, excellent zoning, and you know some good. Uh, I guess you could say tricks or you know have good reads or I don't know. Like yeah. as soon as I can come, words are hard. <laughs> so as soon as I can find them, I'll I'll share those. But yeah, Scarlet is amazing. Um, it was so fun. I didn't get to play this the beta as much as I would have liked because uh, I was working all weekend. I also didn't get my code until the second day of the stress test and I got that in the middle of my shift and it was like last weekend I had to work both jobs um, so yeah I think I got like a grand total of like four hours of play time <laughs> so yeah um, I was kind of disappointed by that but I was just very uh, grateful that I was able to at least get as much play time as I did. Uh, I didn't get to try out Scorpion, I didn't get to try out Baraka, um, but uh, I can tell you just, I did fight some really good Scorpions, I do like Scorpion, I'm still considering whether or not I'm going to learn Scorpion, if I'm going to uh, have him as part of my quote unquote team. Um, he is interesting, I like his stance cancels a lot, uh, we'll see, we'll see. Uh, Baraka, uh, he just, I just don't really care for Baraka. Um, I've never really cared for him ever since Mortal Kombat 2. I just, this whole playstyle just doesn't fit me. Uh, but if it fits you, go for it. You have my blessing. <laughs> uh, I still think his uh, zoning is too powerful for what, for his archetype. Uh, I don't like his zoning, I think it's too strong. Um, but, you know, I guess he needs something, I guess. I don't know. Uh, I'm not the one making the game, so I guess my opinion doesn't really matter that much. Uh, so, yeah. Anyway, those are kind of my initial thoughts. I'm super excited for the beta to come out uh, this next week, the 28th. Um, especially since uh, I'm super stoked about Jade. Um, I've always have liked Jade since uh, MK3. And uh, I didn't get to play... Uh, I don't know if you remember, but like uh, I was, I kind of left the MRS community for quite some time and spent most of my uh, fighting game uh, history in Super Smash Brothers and in Soul Calibur. Um, 
So I missed Mortal Kombat 9, so I didn't get to play Jaden there. But I also understand that she wasn't um, that great, <laughs> I guess you could say. Uh, which makes me sad because I've always liked Jade. And I am very happy to see her come back and I'm super stoked to try her out. Um, I think this weekend uh, is going to be uh, not quite as busy <laughs> as last weekend was. So I'll get, hopefully get some more time and also have access to those to the classic powers. I never could get them to work right for me uh, during the stress test, but it'll be nice to actually get to have some kind of a pseudo practice time with uh, the characters just to kind of get to know them start taking some notes i guess um but yeah so anyway yeah i'm super excited uh we had the reveal yesterday kotal khan and jackie um i i didn't really play much mkx i was more interested in quan chi and aramak uh with a little bit that i did play i did play the story mode and so you know, it did kind of force you to play a little bit of Jackie. And I, you know, I remember thinking, you know, I liked her. Uh, I thought she was a little awkward to play. Um, but, like, I didn't think that she was a bad character. But, like I said, I didn't play MKX very much, but I know that she wasn't considered great. Um, however, like, whenever I see, like, Rewind playing Jackie and totally bodying people, <laughs> kind of makes me wonder about that assessment. Um, but I, yeah, Jackie looks absolutely amazing. I'm really, uh, she's definitely on my short list of characters, uh, as well as Kotal, actually. He kind of reminds me of, uh, I guess you could almost say, like, almost like a, a really tall Wonder Woman in Injustice 2. You know, he's got the totems. She gives him certain buffs, kind of like her Hera, like, kind of like her Blessing of the Gods uh, character trait. Um, he's really good with that mid-range just kind of like how she was in Injustice 2 so I'm, I'm really thinking that I'm probably going to play a little bit of Mise and Kotal whenever that comes out um, so far the characters that I'm the most interested in uh, Scarlet, Jade, and Kotal obviously. I also really like Cassie Cage um, I don't think she's going to be too great but she just looks a lot of fun I she kind of makes me think of Harley a little bit. Just, you know, not, you know, a solid character, but not great. Uh, but, you know, it's got some good tricks up her sleeves. So I'm really excited about that. And then I'm also really interested in Jackie. Um, Raiden and Scorpion. Um, we'll just, but we'll see. You know, those three are my short list. Um, but yeah. Anyway, um, so yeah, those are some of my thoughts on some of the recent news uh, with you know, the stress test beta and yesterday's reveal. Um, and I'm hoping to have uh, my next uh, practice video, uh, how to practice on a time budget. Uh, hopefully this Sunday, I've got some really, really good ideas. I just gotta get them written down and organized. Uh, anyway, uh, so enjoy the rest of this video. Uh, some really good gameplay from this uh, guy. He obviously had a lot of time with Scarlet, and I really appreciated that. Um, so yeah, and uh, as always, you know, leave, leave me a like, helps me out. Subscribe, especially if you want to learn how to practice on a time budget. Um, remember, that's for anybody who's wanting to, you know, start out fresh. Anyone who wants to play competitively but lives that adult life that <laughs> keeps getting in the way. Yeah, I always think of uh, that Mark Twain qu quote, um, school keeps on getting in the way of my education. <laughs> yeah, that's, it's, I feel like that quote applies to here as well. Anyway, uh, yeah, so uh, I'll see you Sunday, hopefully, and uh, peace out. Sure.
Finish her! 